to another Tabless Glass Emporium YouTube video. Again, today we're looking at items I found at the shops that I wanted to zhuzh up with a bit of beautiful fused glass to make them into something special. And today we're looking at these. These were two items. They looked like this when they were at the shop. And I have just added some fused glass to the other side to make them into two extra special Easter decorations. So today I'm going to show you how to make these. So for these two, I um, wanted to, to, to cut the shapes out of white glass. I want to kind of do, I'm going to keep the front sides of them and I'm going to glue glass to the back side so that actually they'll look nice both ways. Now, this is, was my lesson learned. The first one I drew around and I ended up with a black mark on it now, which isn't going to look that pretty. Now I can paint it if I could be bothered, but I probably can't. Um, so for the chicken, I actually decided to photocopy it and then use that. I'm going to go try, try to go a tiny bit bigger rather than smaller um, because I want to make sure that maybe there's a tiny bit of an overlap rather than it being right on the line. I mean, it's a tiny bit bigger. So when I'm cutting this, I'll cut on outside the Sharpie line, not inside. And the same with this. This one I can just cut out with, um, with my uh, glass cutter. This one, some of it I'll cut out with my glass cutter and some of it I will do on the Taurus, um, sort of 50-50. Uh, so I'm going to get these cut out and then I can show you how to decorate.
So here they are, ready to go in the kiln, and we can see what they look like when they come out. Here are these out of the kiln. I think they look great, and I'm just going to glue them to the wooden objects. So here are they glued onto their wooden, um, their wooden backing bits. I think they work really well. I love this, and it sort of inspired me with lots of new ideas and things I can do. Um, you know, if you've got a good carpenter around, you could easily get them to cut these shapes or make a little box. Or you can, as I did, if you don't have a good carpenter around, find sort of cheap things in shops that you can add glass to to make them into something special. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. Remember, you can get all our products at tablasglassemporium.com and please subscribe to our newsletter on our website. Uh, like this video, share this video, do comments. All of those things help us keep doing these kind of videos. Until next time, happy fusing. Mm -hmm.